you be spending a lot of time on your business, the whole point of working on the business is to systemize the business so that it can work in your absence as if you're present. That's what management and successful business is all about. So if you don't have a system for selling, the buyer is going to have a system for buying. So you need to make it in your system and make sure that you are following your system and don't let him maneuver either way. Right? First mistake is trying to sell an organization who doesn't have pain. If you're trying to sell and you realize this person doesn't have a personal pain, don't sell to them. Move on. That's why a lot of salespeople are wasting a lot of time trying to tell sell to somebody who doesn't want to buy. There will be a need. He must be a need. And remember the people that are taking the most information are the people that are not going to buy. Because in these big companies, different people have different types of pain. Okay, so who, where is this issue originating? Is where this issue will get closed. Okay, like in, in hotels, what happens is a lot of times the booker gets rated on how the user department rates the hotel. So the pain is originating in the user department, not in the admin department. This is not on complaints because his KPI is no, it's not complaints are. Are clear? So you want to make sure where is the pain within the organization. Okay, so these are immediate thinking, behavior skills. These are the three parts. You obviously want to think win-win. Sales is always about trust. The other person should feel joy in his benefit. And if you don't qualify the person and can't add value, because people tend to think sales is transaction. Take this guy's money and run. But a lot of people don't know, even as owners I should know, what is the LC lifetime customer value of a particular person. If I can get this customer to stick with me for one year, two years, five years, I can earn from him lifelong. Because the most difficult thing to a business is the customer. So the lifetime customer value is what makes sense. And that's only get built on trust. So one is a lot of persistence. You need to have a lot of persistence. Don't believe anybody that says it can't be done. Just because somebody else didn't do it doesn't mean that you can't do it. You need to understand everything as a, everything as a combination. Life is a telephone number. If you knew the telephone number of anybody in this world, you could call them, correct? But if you don't know the, if you just know the numbers and you don't know the sequence, you're still going to make wrong calls. So the first step is getting to know the numbers, and the second step is knowing the sequence. Once you know this fundamental, or once your brain accepts this fundamental of life, that everything is a tele like a telephone number. Everything has a formula to it. Success is a formula. You just have to repeat the same system, the same process. The problem is we see where they are today without getting into Because remember, who said a successful very rarely tells you all the things that made them successful. It takes a lot of effort to really understand what they did. They would have done many different things, which we only know one part that made them successful. But we don't know the things that got them there. The pain we don't know. The pain we don't know, exactly. And Every business entrepreneur, I'm sure everybody in this room, you would have not done this one business alone. You would have done 10 things, met 10 different people, tried 10 different products, and one of those product clicks that made you successful. Yeah, and then 15 years down the line, everybody will get, Are you still a successful one? They will never get to know the struggle, the pain, the problem, these sessions, what it. The more you get to know, that's what I'm saying. The first step is knowing the numbers, and the second is knowing the sequence. People only know half the numbers. Anything I can replicate. It's like a telephone number. You will keep making wrong calls. And then they get frustrated. And you know, I mean, why would you cut around, we cut around? No.